Will Obi-Wan return in episode 8 as a force ghost? Well, let's talk more after this. We all know that Ewan McGregor played Obi-Wan in the prequel trilogy. Now despite the fact that the prequels got a lot of hate and rightfully so, the one shining beacon of hope was always Ewan McGregor as many can agree that his portrayal of the character was great although wasn't utilized by George Lucas to his full potential. But he might get his chance after all. In a recent interview, Ewan McGregor was very open to the idea of returning to play Obi-Wan Kenobi in whatever project they have got going on, while also adding that he is not in talks with anyone at the moment, which we all know could be false, he just can't share it yet. With episode 8 in the works, many have been speculating about Ewan coming back to reprise his role as Obi-Wan again, and of course there are many more possibilities. One rumor that comes to mind is the Obi-Wan trilogy that many websites have rumored to be in talks, maybe even an appearance in Rogue One. If I was in charge, I would put him in everything. Let's go for the hat trick. But seriously, what if he appears as a force ghost in episode 8? The logical thing is that if he appears in episode 8, he would do so only to advise Luke and Rey, maybe even impart wisdom and training and the force itself. Kind of like Obi-Wan did in episode 5 where he showed up while Luke was training with Yoda and shared his thoughts with Luke, giving him advice and sharing his knowledge. In this case though, Luke would be Yoda in theory and Obi-Wan would be himself, from a certain point of view. A little easter egg for you guys there, please let me know down in the comments would you like to see Ewan be back in episode 8 as a force ghost or maybe in another project where he can play the older Obi-Wan Kenobi. So that's it for today. Now if you want the latest news and theories about other franchises such as Marvel and DC, go ahead and subscribe to my second channel at Movieville. Also follow me on Twitch where we do live streams every week, join me on Twitter. Also now you can become my patron where you can get access to some great rewards. And lastly, be sure to check out my website at bestie.com where we post almost daily all the news and the theories that can't make it on my main channels, you can find it over there. That's it, be sure to subscribe for more and thank you for watching Bessie, where my fans are my besties.